Electronic portfolio is, at its most basic level, a collection online that's available through the web. So uh, an electronic portfolio has a web interface, and it's a place that is often owned by the students at the college level. But it's a place where students can make public uh, work that they are doing. So the idea is, is to collect evidence of your life. Uh, for more curricular purposes, then you're collecting work that's related to a course you're taking. And again, this can be a, a sequence of papers, it could be a sequence of lab reports or, uh, or an internship experience. Portfolios also are buying into and helping to support the new discovery that learning is more social than we used to think, not so much individual. Group work, students can work in groups and produce group projects. This is. The collaborative learning that we have been talking about in education for the last 20 to 30 years, but which we now can do more easily, manage more easily, because of technologies like electronic portfolios. Well, in, in its most uh, basic uh, definition, uh, you know, a portfolio, which is a concept that really isn't new. It's been around for a long time, actually. I can remember when I was in grade school, I had a history pro uh, teacher in I think it might have been as early as eighth grade or seventh grade who had us create portfolios. But, and you know, in, in the early days of uh, the use of portfolios in education, they basically were scrapbooks, you know, just put in a bunch of uh, samples of your work, uh, organize them in some fashion, put a fancy uh, cover on it and turn it in. Um, and I think that now today, portfolios have really, really evolved into much, much more powerful, significant tools for learning. So that they're not just scrapbooks, they're not just uh, collections of artifacts uh, or uh, outcomes of, of coursework. And, uh, but they are that to some degree, but much more importantly, they also involve the power of reflection in getting, helping students to understand that it's not enough just to have information to accumulate uh, knowledge. Electronic portfolios enabled a learner to connect the curriculum to the co-curriculum and to connect one course to another and to make their learning visible. So to have an opportunity to capture electronically in a dynamic format, storable, transportable, and transportable is especially important for our learners today, because even beyond community colleges, learners are attending more than one college. They're stopping out between courses and coming back. People are lifelong learners today.